G'day guys, Luke here from Australian Off-Road. Um, you'll see I'm inside a trailer in the factory so there might be a bit of a background noise but hopefully we can uh, we can get rid of most of that when we edit the video but just really what I want to take this opportunity to showcase um, because it's been a strong talking point in our world over the last couple of months is the new battery regulation. So um, the battery regulations changed um, I'm going to say about three months ago in terms of there was a new legislation put in play uh, where the batteries had to be um, repositioned positioned um, or that was the initial outlining so obviously we had to start to adapt things and get ready for this um, there was a late change to the ruling just before everything kind of took um, took effect in our world and it actually changed to where the batteries could stay in their locations where they didn't have to be vented externally um, but the van the, they had to be boxed in so basically being that we fit our batteries underneath the seats we had to keep them in that location but box them in so they were compressed in from the rest of the components and then actually vent them through through the floor externally so um, I'm going to showcase this box for you just so you can see how, obviously what we're doing and what's changed um, and then obviously just highlight a few things as we go so straight away I'll just get you to kind of shine down onto this box so you can kind of see what's happening so this particular trailer has got the 2 by 300s in so the, these are the new bigger batteries that we offer which is offering 600 amps in total now you'll see straight away this is in a housing um, obviously a metal housing there where it's compressed in and can find a way from the other components where you can see your inverters sitting outside of this so the batteries sit into a tray where we can obviously lock them in so you'll these, see these straps running across the top of the batteries which are holding them down nice and secure um, you'll see off to the side on these particular batteries we've got the terminal blocks now where these filter off to you can see that these connections on the side of the box as well so being that obviously we don't want to have to keep taking the lid off and getting into this box um, we actually run to connection blocks to the external of the box where we, then we can filter on the rest of the components and fuse everything so you'll see that these are nicely labeled so we know which one is which um, and then just to touch on the box a little bit more when we put this together we fully silicon it off so you may see on these videos that a lot of the points um, where you've got rivets or you've got nut inserts for it fixing together it's actually siliconed in and then down in this bottom corner you'll actually see that it's got a hose that runs through the floor um, so that hose is actually venting the box to the external of the trailer so through the floor so very similar to the way we do our gas compartment boxes um, on particular models when the gas bottles are sitting inside we actually vent externally which is a legal requirement um, same thing here so any gases any heat buildup, we can obviously escape that externally rather than it being in this area so there's a lot of form that we fit in through this box as well where we fit different components so we're obviously using timber on the side where the connection blocks are not the metal whereas the metal will run on the opposing sides where we haven't got connections coming through so on this ply board you'll see that this form here as well so again additional sealing to make sure everything's nice and tight and locked in once we seal this off together and then there's actually a lid which will be the last thing that sits on top of this so once this is fixed on there again this has got all form from the underside so we can see where it's all compressing down and sealing off so when you actually come to look in the trailer that is physically what you would see so you would not have quick access to the batteries through this new ruling but it just means that obviously they're nice and secure and they're actually locked away from everything else and vented externally so hopefully that gives everyone a good update on what we've done and uh, how things have changed slightly in our world around this new ruling